And we're live. Hello, everybody. I am at one of my favorite little thrift stores. We are at Dog Dog Junkers on this beautiful Las Vegas afternoon. How is everyone? I see some familiar names over in the live chat. Welcome in, welcome in. All right, this is going to be fun. I have not been here since I made a ginormous donation to them, uh, like the, the many of the racks and displays and uh, merchandise from the Good Stuff Thrift Store ended up coming here uh, because they so graciously stepped in and brought volunteers in to help me get the store empty. So it was a very, it was a very big blessing to be able to have them come in and do that. People are driving like crazy out here. <laughs> I was gonna flip the camera around and think that we're gonna see like a, some action, action shot. And I've also been out this morning going yard sailing with some of my favorite people in the whole wide Hi. world. Hi, we got everyone. Gary and Harleen. Will is at a hockey game. So, so he's not here, but Will and Harleen have come with me to come shop uh, dog junkies with you. Now I have to flip this camera around. Stand by. This is always kind of a fun thing to do with StreamYard. You gotta, you gotta pick the camera. And I'm on their Wi-Fi, so I'm hoping that, there we go. I'm hoping that uh, our signal stays strong. Sorry, I hit the wrong button. <laughs> All right, we're going in. <laughs> oh, goodness. We had a very fun morning. Oh, I was explaining how uh, hopefully our signal stays good uh, because I am on their Wi-Fi instead of just using the signal from my phone. Look at that cute little, little thing there. Ooh, Limoges, Limoges. Let's look at the mark. Can I hand that to you for a second, just so I can show them the mark on these beautiful plates. Limoges makes some gorgeous plates. Okay, it is Haviland and decorated by Haviland and Company. $10 a plate. I put a little Beatrix Potter back on there. Yes, I'm back, sorry about that. 74 in Palm Springs. That sounds kind of heavenly for Palm Springs. Oh, this is very sweet. I kind of like this. I'm a little sucker for the uh, kind of that baby blue. And let me know if you guys can hear the music. As long as you can't hear the music, I'm okay. But there is music on in the background. So I just want to make sure if anybody hears that music, let me know. Because they will turn it down for me. They're very good that way. I kind of like this. I kind of think I'm going to put that in my pile. Okay, my comments... Stop scrolling. There they go. Okay. Okay. You can't hear it. Fantastic. Yeah, Excellent. All right. I'm going to start my pile with this little piece right here. I'm kind of leaning towards those uh, little dessert glasses back here. These are great. It's a set of four in yellow, green, purple, and orange. I wish there was a blue. If there was a blue and a red, I'd be a little more leaning towards them. I don't know. And you guys can help me make decisions. That's why I like to bring you along to help make the hard decisions. I'll put this down there, give it a little accent. Are these some um, garlic graters? I think they are little garlic graters. Um, not directly, but you can help me make decisions for things to go put over into the niche lady shop. So in a way, yes, in a way you can buy um, because if there's something you really want, you can let me know and then I can get it listed in my, in my shop. Oh, those are hankies. What are those like big buttons? They are big buttons. Got some 
inverted thumbprint, yellow depression glass. I'm going to try to follow the comments as closely as I can. And I just got started, Pat. So I have comments coming in both from Facebook and from YouTube. So if you see me responding to a comment, you're like, I don't see what she's responding to. That's because it could be somebody over on Facebook. It's got an interesting pattern. What is that? T, F, and S made in England, Phoenix. Antique doilies and embroidered napkins. Okay, I'll keep an eye out for those for sure. Let's see. I usually get some pretty fantastic jewelry from this store, so we'll definitely be perusing the jewelry. Lizzie liked the mug you were looking at. Oh, the mug? Let's go back and look again. It's got like a bit of a, a Native American kind of flair to it. Really it does. But I think it's a hobby piece. Don't Perhaps. you think? I don't know. It's well done. Because it looks, but see how it's not quite shaped completely round? I think mm -hmm. it's I think it's a hobby piece. Jewelry. There's so many things that look familiar, like those. <laughs> I donated, you know, a lot of the big stuff that I don't really want to ship that was up on my stage. Oh, how cute is that? That looks like a real uh, little needle craft was put in a frame. I think that's what it is too, yeah, for six bucks. That's very sweet. Ooh, you have oh, you love Israel. Oh, that's what I love about coming on this time of the day. I get people from all over the world. It's so cool. Ooh. Oh, it's a swan. I was thinking it was a shell, but the uh, handle is the swan neck. It's kind of pretty. It's kind of pretty, actually. I'm going to be a little bit picky today. Just because um, you should see how much stuff I've been buying the last couple of shopping trips that haven't showed up on video yet. Uh, but they will be <laughs> tomorrow, tomorrow. Tomorrow's isn't the big, big doozy. It's um, the day after tomorrow. You're going to see some doozy doozies. Look at these guys. Oh, my goodness. How cute are they? It says as is, though. I don't see the. I don't see the as is on it. Oh, oh, it's missing a ducky. It's missing a whole ducky. <laughs> but you know what? It doesn't matter because it displays with the two duckies just fine. Oh, and these are super cute. Look at these little Pepsi Cola salt and peppers. I love these. I don't know how much they are. Is it? Is it? Do they have it on the box? Maybe. No, there's no pricey poo on these. They're pretty darn cute, though. Let's see. I have to keep talking because there is music behind me right now. Um, those are those are a maybe. Those are a maybe. Those are a definite maybe. Okay. Well, I'm gonna come back to them though. Let's get in here a little bit. I see some pretty stuff in these cases too that I'm gonna come back to. I got Noah texting me. $24 for the hen on nest. You sell a lot of those, don't you, Harleen? I do. <laughs> it, it, like, <laughs> it's, it's settled all on its own. Ooh, these are pretty. Look at those. They've got like some crackling that I, I'm not sure is original to the piece. It almost, I don't know. You see that? 
And it's, yeah, I don't think that's supposed to be like that. I think these are, they're actually acrylic now that I, yeah, they're acrylic. And they got a little, a little crazing. I have, oh, I see them all over the place. I see them all over the place, Gail. They're here. Like those plants right there. And let's see, the elephant jaw right there. <laughs> this is kind of a fun piece. Let's see who makes this. It doesn't say who makes it. It's a cute little vintage. Okay, thoughts on that? Am I alone in liking it? Kind of like it. What about that elephant? What about that elephant? Oh, you like this? All right. I think I'll put that in my pile because it's really cute. Oh, well. oh, I love having an extra set of hands. <laughs> it's just a yes? That's a yes. All right. So which, which elephant are we looking at? I don't want to ship him. That's why I donated him. <laughs> He's huge. Oh, this is one of those musical instruments. It would have a little um, piece that sits in there, but then you take it out. It's like a percussion instrument. Oh, it's a bear. I wasn't sure what that was. Got some things behind here. Oh, the bunny played. It's very, very cute. Look at that. It's a green box. So this tag here is a wholesale tag. This means it came from World Mar We have a World Market here. And um, so this is the wholesale pricing. So six fifty, and then a retailer is going to at least double that price, if not triple. So you could get a whole case of these for $26. It. They have samples. Uh, we have a sample sale here in Vegas that we get to go to. So somebody obviously bought that at the sample sale. You know what? I think I'm going to put it in the pile because Easter's coming and it's really super cute. And then I'm going to look at the Fitz and Floyd Oceana. Okay, what is that? What is that? It's 19... 50, 60, 77, 1977. Do I have it right? One of my favorite Fitz and Floyd's patterns, obviously, because it's like the ocean life. It's a, it's a show. Oh. <laughs> better, better in than on the floor, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. They would forgive me. I'd have to buy it, but they'd forgive me. Um, it's missing a little spoon. I think it goes... I don't know. That fits in there kind of odd. But anyway, I, I think I'm going to leave it. I think I'm going to leave it. Let's see what else we've got. Oh, that's a great idea. Why haven't I ever thought of that? Put a big shell in a macrame? That's a great idea. Because I'm out of like shelf space, but I'm not out of like hanging space. I like that idea. Hi, Kimberly. Kim, first time here. Welcome, welcome. Oh, I see. I see golden retrievers. Picard. Oh, that's actually a really nice brand. Picard. Little golden. Noah did not get his golden retriever. Um, he got... A big old, a big old doggy instead. You got the precious moments, little circus figures. You know, I'm looking, I'm just, I'm looking at this one. That's the only, that's, that's the one I'm looking at. Oh, this is what I'm smelling. These soaps, lemon and dried rose. Oh, it's wax. Oh my. Oh, that was potent when I put it up to my nose. Sweet orange. Okay. Oh, oh. Do you like pina colada? 
Mm-hmm. Do you like pina colada? I do. You like getting caught in the rain? I do. <laughs> I can't go to the next line though. <laughs> <laughs> Something you do at midnight. <laughs> That's a great song. It really is. Long live Jimmy Buffett. That's a beautiful pillow. Michael Design Works. And it's got birds. I don't have my bird couch anymore. I used to have a bird couch. A couch that only had bird pillows on it. I mean, I could put bird, bird pillows on my couch now. But I have a dog who likes to chew things now. Not like, not because she likes to chew pillows. Just because she would think it's a toy for her. And that it was meant to be chewed. And we can't have that. How's our signal doing? Are we still okay? Can you still see me? Hopefully. It was beautiful. Look at these. Fitness tracker, your body diary on the wrist. Well, I don't need that. I don't I don't want to keep track of how little I uh work out. <laughs> Although I did a walk through our one of our outlet malls yesterday, and I didn't realize how long of a walk that really was. You know, you get to one end and you go, oh my gosh, I got to walk all the way back now. But I'm pretty proud of myself. I found Jordan a birthday present. I'm not going to say anything about it because she does watch some of these. And I'm like, not going to say, I'm not going to say what it is or where it came from. But you'll see it'll it's gonna show up in video very soon because I'm gonna go take it to her. I've got some Reuben glass. Those are very colorful little masks, little terracotta masks from Mexico. I recently found out that these are actually pure one. I'm attracted to things that I've donated. Like, oh, I would buy those again. <laughs> Here's a little Annette Creations. She makes all these wonderful little things. Still no music. That's good. I'm a little bit further away from the music right now, so you shouldn't hear it. It's this little poodle here. Oh, he's got a broken, little broken head. But look at these little guys. Oh my gosh, they're so small. Little small, dainty little poodles. Goodness. That's an old piggy bank. I love how they have a whole rack for their doggy clothes. Oh. I didn't even know that rack came down to this size. This was our dress rack. It used to be like way tall up here. And now they're using it to hang all their doggy clothes from and some purses. That's fantastic. I don't dare. I don't dare dress up my dogs. They get so offended. <laughs> Though I have to tell you, Peanut is over the moon having a new friend. She loves having a bigger dog run the show. She still acts like she runs the show, but she really doesn't. She she really loves being second in line, second in command. If you wear size six or seven, ask to see the new Tom shoes. Oops, wait, where did that go? The new Tom shoes that just came in. Oh, okay. I don't. I wear an eight. How do you deal with a chewy dog? Get them stuff to chew on so they don't. Oh, yeah, yeah. We, we are. We definitely are. And But see, her thing is, like, she just loves tug of war. She just really loves tug of war. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's a very, very large dog and a very strong dog. And... Um, you know, she means well. We love her. Oh, those are really cute. I wish I could wear a little bit of a platform like that because those are really cute, but I cannot. 
can't do it. Can't do it. 400 people. Oh, welcome in, everyone. The true spirit of Aloha Surfer Girl. Okay, well, that's different. Interesting. These are some more of Annette's creations. Look at these little scenes that she makes. Is that the queen? Let me see. Past time. The queen mother. It's Queen Elizabeth, the queen mother. How much are you? 20? The royal stuff is, is very, very pricey. Let's see what that is. Restaurant something. Antoine. Restaurant Antoine. So it's a little restaurant where like espresso. It's Shenango. That's pretty cool. See, I get my exercise. I do thrift store squats. Do it all the time. How's my signal back here? Because I am in the far back corner of the store. I thought I would test it and see. Pastimes was a retro store here in the UK. Oh, okay. Was the jar Hadley? No, I don't think so. Yeah, she is a good protector. She has shown us already she'll be a good protector. My pool guy showed up and I thought she was going to go right through the back door after him, <laughs> which was great. She will protect us. Look how pretty that dress is. I don't wear dresses, but that is really cute. Oh, good. All right. We got a good signal still. You're getting lots of hellos, Harleen. Everybody was saying, like, are you still friends with Picker Road? We haven't seen you with them. Well, they were traveling. Hi, Linda. Good to see everyone. And Lisa, no, that jar wasn't Hadley. It's German pottery. Oh, it was German? Uh -huh. Okay. I liked it, too. They wanted 25 for that one. Yeah, you guys were away for, what, three weeks? We had the film festival. It was a long time. And then William went away for like, two weeks. So we were gone for like a month. Y yeah, a month. Well, William was. Yeah, it was a long time. We are this time. like this is our first time really getting together since they got back. It's pretty awesome. Oh, look, it's a cabbage patch kid dog. That's interesting. I am going to be getting my plush store opened back up. I'm pretty excited. I have I have something that I am going to be testing and I'm I'm hoping like if all goes well, then I can pass the info on to you guys because I think it's going to really be a game changer. But I'm going to test it first. I'm going to I'm going to make sure before I promote it that that all is well. But then I will be sharing how I'm going to run a complete eBay store and do no work. <laughs> I'm just going to get paid. I'm just going to do the shopping part and the collecting money part. How fun will that be? Let's see what we got back here. I want to sing along with the songs that are going because it's good old 90s country. 80s, 90s country. That is early California authentic Vernonware. Oh, it's Vernonware. Okay. It's a fun piece. You sold three plush. Plush is a good seller because every age group loves plush. Obviously, kids love plush. There are collectors for certain types of collectible plush. Adults give plush as gifts. There's a wide, wide market for plush. I'm trying to think if I need some more of these for my fish food. I don't think so. I think I'm good. I think I'm good right now. Well, Susan, I might have the answer for you. Now, there, it won't be like super breakable stuff. Anyways, at least to start. Um, it's going to be things like clothing and shoes and plush and toys and electronics and that kind of thing. 
but it's going to be a complete solution. So I'm, I'm excited. All right, I am itching to go up and look at some jewelry. How about you guys? And here, this, this is the Oh, I need I need that lamp back actually. <laughs> I actually sold that lamp. I actually need the pink one. Oh, the pink one. Yay! I can't I didn't know why I couldn't find it. Okay. That is so cute. <laughs> They'll let me. <laughs> Boop. I'm gonna hand that to you. That's so funny. You are stronger than you think. I like that. I like this little box. You know what? I'm going to put that in my pile too. Okay, let me sneak by here. Absolutely. And let's see if we can. See, they've got a table here in front, so we're going to have to do a little moving around here to see inside there. Oh, I like that pin. Oh, is it a fur clip? It's a fur clip. It's not a pin. It's like a moonstone fur clip. What is a turquoise tiered tray? Turquoise tiered? Oh, it's just like a, like a, it's newer. It's contemporary. Oh, I like, is that a fish back there? Dragonfly. Oh, look at these kitties. I know it's just a little fashion one, but it's awful cute. I'm going to open this up and peek inside. I'm going to peek. This is where the good stuff is. Oh, these are nice earrings. Oh, it's earrings and a bracelet set. Look at the little bows. $45 for the earrings, necklace, and bracelet. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's the bracelet. Oh, that's a sweet little set. I, I haven't seen Dawn on here yet, but I bet Dawn would be saying get it. For all three pieces? Look at that. So spring, too. Look at that little set. I think we're going to get that. I think we're going to get that one. Little turquoise. Little bag okay. of turquoise. Oh. Let me go back. I've missed some of your comments. Oh, she's here, but she's getting her nails in. Oh, it's got to be killing her not to be able to type in the chat then. Huh? <laughs> you have not missed much yet, Chelsea. No, we haven't been on here too long. About 30 minutes. Okay, I think I caught up. Yeah, isn't it, Susan? Yeah, I think so. I think so. I think so. Oh, look at the wood on this. Look at the. I think that's wood, right? Is that wood? Sure. Yeah. Well, polished wood. That's really cool. Yes. That's really cool. Let's see what else we got. We've got a marcasite. Sterling silver fish. He is 35. Give me a D. Oh no, there really is. There really is a D there. Ooh. And you pretty little pretty little beads. 40. Did you want to take those are nice. I think they're glass, though. I don't think they're stone. They're cold. They are cold. 
but I think a glass. I am getting a jewelry tester and bringing it with me everywhere. <laughs> Can you do that? Is there a portable one? Mine's too big to take everywhere. I've seen portable ones. I hope I can. That would be cool. Portable one. These are. Oh, I get it. The clip goes this way. Mm. Just wonder if those are garnet. Yeah, I know, right? Well, they look like garnet. You think so, and not know. glass? Without a without a jewelry tester, right? So yeah, look for sure that they're garnets. They might be a little too purple to be garnet. They're nice. They're very nice. Those are fun too. If Susan thinks the same thing as you, that they might be garnet, you guys think so? There are 40, though. I don't know if I can do 40. Yeah. Just, yeah. just can't quite do that. Look at the marks on these. 925, and then there's something else on there. Cute little stars. Those are 34. Amethyst, Swarovski, Amethyst. 60. I was in the Swarovski outlet store yesterday. And uh, oh my gosh, the prices. Holy smokers. Swarovski is. Up there. I think that's a bone. Open the class and see if it's marked. It's a good idea. If it was, uh, if it was a real stone, chances are the class would be 14 carat. This looks old, too. Oh, what's this? What's this? 150 for this little fetish necklace. But look at, look at the animals. I know. Oh, squirrel. And I don't know what that one is. It's a fish. Look at the animals on this. They're incredible. Oh, my goodness. We'll have updates for you. Have a good day. Thanks. You as well. Take care. Thank you. I love this. I love this. I just can't. I can't do 150 on it, though. Is that it's sure it's like 15? I don't think so. No. No, that would be 150. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 150. It's a pretty, yeah, it's, I mean, this is a nice I fetish. Sterling. And the clasp is not marked. Not so marked. I think it's, I think you're right. I think it's stone. Or I mean glass. Or glass. Glass, yeah. But, um, yeah, it's pretty. I mean, a friend of mine used nonetheless. Perfectly, so. Okay, I am gonna I am gonna get that set though. We are gonna get that one. Let's see what's up here. Paparazzi. There's so much paparazzi stuff out there now. Oh my goodness. Okay. We don't want to put this over there though. They'll keep this back here. You got a you got a secret spot to keep that for me. Oops. Oh, I knew I was going to do that. Let me look in here. There's another mystery jewelry jar. I have so many mystery jewelry jars right now. I don't dare. I don't dare. Oh, that's a nice piece. Oh, yes. Thank you. It's got a. Looks like an Asian mark on there. Do you want this as well? I don't think so. Oh, no, no, I don't need, that's your, that's your display. These are like little, little chakra pendants. Oops. Now, Dawn is agreeing with me and saying that it is garnet. Oh, well, what does she know? 
<laughs> just kidding. I'm just kidding. The little humor. Hey, I said. <laughs> I said it was darn it. This is this is kind of a sweet. Uh, it's got a, a darkened stone on the. Open that up. <laughs> Trying to see if it was Whiting and Davis. Okay, yeah, I'm kidding. Yes, I am kidding. I know I have to clarify that. That's really nice though. What is this one? It looks like a little cigarette case. How does that open? Oh, there it is. It is a cigarette case, isn't it? I've sold that or similar. Look how cool that is. It's 40. That's really cool. I like it. Got some rings. That one's elephants. Oh, is that a turtle? It is a turtle. How much are you? He is 22. It's, he must be silver. Must be. It's a pretty little, looks like. Got some black black onyx, 22. You're getting hungry? I just had a uh, Starbucks turkey ciabatta something, something. That was really, really good. These are cute. And a strawberry acai refresher. It's, it's breaking me of my Dr. Pepper habit because I can nurse one of those all day long. It's her little handmade, handmade pendant. It's more down there. Okay, let's go to the front of the jewelry cabinet. Oh my gosh, I got to tell you something. Um, I actually have this very same skeleton in my aquarium because my being beautiful it's the name of the coral is an acan it's not purple this has been dyed but this makes me think i could dye mine blue and have a big beautiful fossil uh it was a very very expensive coral and long story short different corals fight with different corals and i had another coral encroach on his his little territory and ended up killing him and I didn't catch it in time. And so I have this very, I have that very little coral skeleton. I guess that's the, the consolation of having um, a reef tank is when something dies, at least you still have a memento. Speaking of my strawberry acai refresher, I am taking a sip. So I've been talking all day. I get them with water to avoid the, the extra sugar. Yeah. And I just took a big chunk of strawberry. That wasn't very bright. Okay, let's go. Go over here. It's a good thing. I think those are plastic. I don't think those are stone. They look like it though. We have a caller here that would love to say hi. Oh, sure. Hi. We're live. We're live, but I'd love to say hi. Absolutely. Yeah. Do you, why don't you get in the picture? Yeah, we can do that. Here, I'm going to let I'm going to let Harleen like show you some jewelry. And I love your son, Will. So oh, thank you so much. We were with Will all morning. <laughs> There's Danny having her hey. meet and greet. <laughs> Absolutely. Always interrupt. Yes. I've got that little swan. Oh, fantastic. And it's a creamer. Excellent. 
she got the little swan I showed. Oh yeah, because well, those fetish necklaces are expensive because each one of those is a little hand carved little little guy. Can we just turn that just while I'm up here that way? That way, YouTube doesn't, you know, throw a fit because YouTube likes to do that. I didn't realize it. Yes. Let's see. Oh, the sloth. Anybody see there was a there was a a video going around of I don't know what country are sloths in. Is it South sloth? America? They're not Madagascar, right? No, no sloth. Still. There, well, we have American sloths, I think, don't we? I don't think we do. Let's find them. Do we? Anyway, so it was some place where sl sloths are actually like they live in the wild, and it got into this house. Oh my god! And man. they showed up, and it was a house that they were refurbishing. He was covered oh. in blue painters tape. Oh my god! I was so sad. They had to like get the, and they couldn't get all the tape off. They had to release him with some of the tape still on him, oh, no. and hope that it wore off. But it was like, oh my gosh! But he had Central and South America. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. South America. They're very tropical. Yeah, they're not the sweet little creatures you guys think they are. Uh, we had two of them up at the Reno Zoo. And uh, when they want to take a swipe at you with those claws right there, uh, you definitely do not want to be in the way. And they can move fast when they want to. Okay, this is, this is pretty incredible. The dog's playing poker. Little figure. Look at each one is in a chair sitting around with their some are smoking cigars. Oh my gosh. You're a Canadian sloth. Stop. <laughs> I think some of us would love to be like a sloth, wouldn't we? Just sloth through the day. Okay, I don't see anything that's really grabbing me here. I'm sure I'm sure Dawn would yell at me if I was passing something by. <laughs> that's a pretty piece on the the white small shells with the kind of mother of pearl there. Oh, that one's interesting. Uh, why do I should know the heart with the crown? Who's the heart with the crown? Yeah, possibly Lorraine. I might, I might do that again. I would do that with whatnot, you know. They do. <laughs> they definitely can. This dress is really good. Oh, look at it. It's got a purse with an owl on it. That's a hoot. What is that? Is that like a tr I'm trying to see tourmaline those. or something? It's that watermelon. Yeah, that real rainbowy. So cute. Is it stone or is it glass? It's I don't know. Stone and glass are both cold. So it's <laughs> not that cold. Okay. That's a cute dress. I had a little debate with my daughter this morning over dresses. Because I'm not a dress wearer. And she wants me to wear a dress at the wedding. And I don't want to wear a dress at the wedding. I just want to wear a nice pantsuit. Because I don't wear dresses. <laughs> and I'm pouting a little bit. She wants me to wear a dress. <laughs> and Taylor. It's an Irish wedding band. Oh, so it's not like a brand. Oh, you're not sure she. Oh, so see, I could talk about her and then she wouldn't know it. You know, for those who may be taking that wrong, no, Dawn is a very, very good friend of mine. I'm just giving her a hard time. 
can I show you what? I have to wear a dress. I really have to wear a dress. I mean, I can. Uh, she wants to go buy me a dress at Nordstrom's, though. And I'm like, no, don't spend that kind of money for a dress I'm going to wear one time. See, that's what I want to do. That's I'd love to wear palazzo pants. Yes, that's what I want to do. You're right. Um, yeah, we're going to discuss it. We're going to discuss it. I'm going out there soon. And we will... Uh, we will come to a we will come to a an agreement about it. That's a cute little faux ostrich purse. Danny for eighteen. Look at they have palazzo pants. <laughs> and I totally I totally could wear that. I'll have to get her approval though. I'll definitely let her approve of whatever I choose to wear. I can I can do that. I have to remind her she said she was going to thrift everything. I just don't want her spending all of that money on a dress. Oh, the mermaid dress must have sold, huh? It used to be hung over here. That's a cute scarf. It's like all these little houses. Who makes you? I don't know who makes you. Oh, what did Gail say? Fixing now. Correct. Yeah, I won't wear white. Is it? Yeah, I know, right? This this is a really nice scarf. Let me look. Let me look a little closer. Oh, and it's a big square one, too. So many of them are like those little thin, narrow ones. I like this. I think I will I'll get this and go and put it in the next accessory, person accessory sale. Because that's, that's, oh, here it is. It's a uh, painted, printed village. Might just be like the pattern. Let, let me see. Oh, hold on. Let me see. There's another tag underneath that tag that might tell me more. Um, polyester. Yeah, I didn't think it was silk. It's just fun. It's just fun. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna put that in the pile. I'm gonna put that in the pile. Is it the yes? This is the yes. They have some really nice clothes here. Really, look at that blue jacket. It's suede. I love that. Ooh, that's fun. I think pretty dresses. Pretty, pretty dresses. Okay, you guys probably don't want to shop clothes. It's not what you came here for. Let me catch up on some comments. Make sure. Chris says, tell your daughter this is the day where mom can wear whatever she wants. I've been to a lot of weddings with the parents of the bride and groom. Wear a pet nice pantsy. Uh, we will work it out. We will definitely work it out. As long as it's in her coloring that she wants for her pictures and everything. She uh, she wants to do a test run of doing my makeup too while I'm out there. I'm like, okay. I did I I do I I dread wearing makeup all day as much as I dread wearing a dress. <laughs> I don't wear makeup. <laughs> She says, Mom, I want you to look good. <laughs> I'm like, okay. She does have good fashion sense. She does. Hello, Roylene. Oh, you love clothes? Okay, well, we can look at clothes. I never shop clothes. But I, I do like to shop clothes. Yeah, she's got a particular palette of colors that she has picked out. I have to look at this little purse. Is this a, is that, 
Is that a Brighton bee? Let's see. Is it? Would it be marked in the inside too? Because there's nothing. Nothing on the inside. Ah! Get it closed. $16. That's a very cute. It's very, very nice quality. Feel the quality of that. Is it leather? I don't think so. Don't think it's leather? It's really nice. It is nice. Put down phone, Harleen. I like the color. The rose. Yeah, my phone is chirping. I need to go see who's chirping me. Oh, Noah finished his race. He didn't tell me how he did. Noah is uh, racing tomorrow, one of his sim leagues. It's the final race of the season, and he is holding on to number one position. So if he wins tomorrow, he is the champion of the season. This is a Vera. It's a pretty Vera. That pink one's made in Korea. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I don't know how much the Vera is. Let's see. There's a tag. 22 on the Vera. She's a cute Vera. Oh, is that a is that a real coach? Mm -hmm. Maybe. It's got some wear. Yeah. They have some really good donors here. For anybody who is in Las Vegas, Dog Junkies is located at Decatur and Craig Road. I can get you the exact address. What is the what is the address here? Gina? Gina? Yes. What's the address here? It's 4324. 4324 North Decatur Boulevard is the actual address. And they are open Tuesday through Saturday uh, from 10 to 4, I believe. That's a Dooney. Dooney with the ducks. 11 to 4. Oh, 9 to 4 on Saturday and 11 to 4 Tuesday through Friday. All right. It's got some. I don't know what happened here. That's a cute Dooney, though. Put it back up there. Look at all the lambs. Oh, let's see. I lost my chat again for a moment. Oh, yeah, I definitely have time to find it. Yes. The wedding is not until the fall. Dress and makeup for wedding and pictures and palazzo pants for reception. Yeah, I hate makeup. I really do. I wear a little bit of eye makeup. That's it. Yeah, oh, we'll be videoing everything. A lot of it may end up over on her channel. But I'll put a little bit on this on mine, too. Sorry, I'm catching up. I'm catching up. Team Purple Goose. Yes. Oh, thank you, Melissa, for putting the address in there. Yeah, so so Dog Junkie supports a Home for Spot, which is a nonprofit that helps dogs that are hard to adopt. They actually are working with the prison program to get the dogs trained. Uh, they do a lot of good. They do a lot of really good work in the dog community. And so all of the proceeds from the sales at this thrift store support those dogs. A lot of them, you know, have medical needs in the thousands of dollars that have to be taken care of. See, that's really cute. I could get behind that little, I mean, not for the wedding, but it's just cute. I love not having to dress up to go to work anymore. I, I got to tell you, I did that. I did that for years. I like to get out of bed, throw on some comfy jeans and a sweatshirt and 
get on with my day. That's that's my idea of uh, life. <laughs> oh, that's a fun, fun little blazer. Scott Taylor. Okay, what haven't we looked at? Where haven't we gone? But things haven't we? I keep coming back to this sweater. I don't know if you saw it when I skimmed by here the first time. Let me pull it out and show you a little better. Look at this. It's um, it's like a little. You'd still have to wear like a cami under there, but it's limbs made in Shanghai, China, hundred percent cotton, and it's got the little over sweater and then the little under. But you'd still you'd still want something under there. That'd be a little risque without something underneath, but that's a very, very sweet little piece there. Uh-oh. Don't snag on something else. And put that there until I have two hands to fix it better. Okay, what do you guys want to look at? What do you want to go see? Have you worn all those outfits you bought a while ago? Um, I think I have worn, yeah. And I've picked out, you know, you pick out favorites. Like, well, I don't know if you, this, I bought this up in Reno. I don't know if you can see it. Um, This kind of blousey blouse. This one I bought in Reno with Dawn and it's one of my faves. You know, you get your favorites, you wear everything once and you go, okay, I'm. that's the one I'm going to wear every time I wash it. <laughs> what is this? Embellishment. Okay, it's cute. Do a lot of people comment about this light fixture here with the little glass baubles? Oh, that's another look. Look at this little Vera. This little crossbody Vera. It's sitting there like right in front of my face, and I almost missed it. This one's ten bucks. I might have to get this one. I'm. I'm kind of loving that bright, happy Vera. Okay, that's going. It's going in my pile over here. Here's our, our little pile. Okay, what should we go back and look at? I feel like I missed a section somewhere. I feel like I did. Oh, somebody was asking about that. I'll show it to you closer. It's it's just like a... Uh, my would be good for like candy or something. Put that back up there. Got some lucite grapes. The whale is very cute. Yes. Oh, Gary got the black light out to show the glow of the grapes. <laughs> How much was the cute Dooney? 10 bucks. It's in my pile. I'm grabbing it. Well, those are aluminum. I expected those to be a lot heavier. They are not. Oh, look at this clock. Look at this clock with the little ballerina in it. I'm sure, we, you know, when the clock strikes, the hour she probably spins around. It's a united self starting clock. Look how old that is. Wow, that is cool. That is cool. I have one of the little fireplace ones because it's what was in the bedroom at my grandmother's house when I used to spend nights there and it just brings back so many good memories will is at a hockey game spent the morning out picking at yard sales and then we dropped him off look at this big lucite just sculpture thing wow hey gary where's that black light, black light coming. let's see if this baby glows no, it's modern acrylic. This is modern. Now, if that glowed, that'd be hard to resist. I'm going to see if I can squeeze through here. Oh, without stepping on anything. I do like that pillow, too. 
Oh my gosh, look at these chickens. Look at these chickens. Look at these dancing chickens. <sighs> these are great. These are great. All right, those might have to go in my pile. I'm, I'm kind of loving them. Okay, what did I miss? The Oh, that's right. We spring forward tonight, don't we? Oh, we sure do. Butterfly lamp. Butterfly lamp. Did I miss a butterfly? Oh, it's not a lamp. It's just a sculpture. It's just a bunch of butterflies in like a orb kind of a thing. They are asking 48 on that. Ooh, look at the tweed on this purse. Yeah, that's that's cool. <laughs> that's not how I anticipated that going. This is what you do when you only have one hand. Oh wow, look at it inside. It's it's truly like a straw purse. I think it's got some age on it. What are your thoughts? I mean, if it's not old, it's got the old vibe. KSL is on the zipper. What are your thoughts on that? Um, it's a little light. It's very 70. Well, it's it's straw. I know. But I think the, le the handles are leather. I think they are, too. No, you no. love it? I'm getting a lot of love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I, I think I'm going to get it. Polish. Yeah, I think I'm I'm going to do it. My spring bag. Can I, can I HTH? Hand to her. <laughs> Gary just heard a trip already. <laughs> and then here's another one. This one is also like a, a straw. I don't like the closure on this one. It's, it feels cheap that the way this one is done. Not quite as good as that other one. Okay, what is there? Oh, we found a Van Gogh. We found a Van Gogh. Okay. Oh, it's a double sided Van Gogh. Look at that. I feel like I could paint that good. I feel like I could do this. No, maybe not. I know, huh? It's always interesting what ends up making a popular artist. Because you look at it and you go, okay, all right. I'm still kind of looking at this pillow. This pillow's kind of calling me too. 16. 16. Oh. I do kind of love it. You know, and I could put it on the couch because I have the bird wall, you know, right above the couch. How much is it? 16. This wasn't yours. Nope. No, I wouldn't have given this one up. <laughs> it's pretty cool. London, 1878. I know, it's a nice, it's a nice, it's a nice pillow. Looking back at comments. Oh, did Dawn say something? Your clocks don't change until the end of the month? This weekend. I in is that another country like oh Dawn says she has sound. Uh oh, we have to be nice then. <laughs> <sighs> They're talking me into the pillow. Okay. I think I kind of need it. You know, if, when something calls at you and calls at you. It feels nice it's too. A bird call. It's a bird call. <laughs> yes. Okay. It's going in my pile. It's going on my couch. It, oh, it's an interesting pairing there. I mean, it works. It's not how it's meant to be, but it works. I hear doggies. I got doggies here. Tomorrow night in Indiana? No, you change tonight. Everybody in the United States doesn't change tonight. Everybody in the United States changes tonight. Right? And the UK changes on the 31st. 
It's so confusing. Why do they do this to us? Why must we change? We don't need to change. We need to just pick it. I think once we go to the spring forward thing, it just needs to stay. Just stay there forever. Don't change. Don't do it. That's a really pretty pewter frame with orchids. Where are you, Wanda, that it's March 10th? Because isn't it like 2 o'clock in the morning on, or is it midnight? Is it midnight or 2 o'clock in the morning? I don't know. It's cause it's, I don't know. What's the official? You do it when you go to bed. I know, right? It just, it, I mean, now it just happens. Your phones update automatic. Your computer updates automatically. Made in Japan. Cute little guy. Two a.m. in Florida. Two in the morning. Because I think they did it at two. Otherwise, it would the dates would be screwed up. So they do it at two to make sure that it doesn't change the date. If you get in the morning and your computer and cell have changed time. Yeah, it's like, okay, it's it's that time when you have to get in your car and go, oh, shoot, how do I reset the clock? I know Arizona doesn't change. That was the nice thing about living in Arizona. Tomorrow is the, t okay, so it is the, t I guess, okay, because two, two in the morning is officially the 10th. Yes, I'm so confused. I know, they just need to leave it alone. Just need to leave it alone. Yeah, everybody usually does it before going to bed. I did, I did love living in Arizona. I don't think I would have ever have left Arizona if it was up to me. I lived in, well, I started out living in Casa Grande and then moved to Marana, which is just outside of Tucson, and then moved into Tucson. And from there, moved up to Reno, and from Reno, moved to Vegas. Yeah, I do a lot of moving. But no more. I'm not moving, no more. Well, somehow, like, that moving out of the store was just as stressful as a house move, if not more stressful. That's a pretty napkin ring. Okay, I think we've seen just about everything. Unless there was something that I didn't look at that you guys wanted me to look at. I don't know if I looked at these purses over here. Let's take a peek. You know, the blue, the blue color caught me there. Red's cute. Cute. Let's go look at this little pile of purses over here. See something that says Betsy, a big old Betsy satchel with hearts. More jewelry? Uh, I think we pretty much looked at all the jewelry. I'll look in the cases one more time. Tucson to Reno was hard. Yeah. Oh, I lived in Reno for one year. I hated it. Hated the cold. Did not. not nope. Didn't like it. Don't ever want to live where it snows again. Yeah. They got the music going back up here again, though. So I got to be careful. Uh, let's see. I think we pretty much saw... All of the jewelry. There was a little bit on. No, there's no jewelry on this side. It's just kind of some little stuff. <laughs> Reno blah. <laughs> no, don't. I know how you feel about Reno. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I don't want to move ever again. Thank yeah. You there's really no more jewelry than what I've shown. No, Sherry, I closed the store. 
Yep, yep, yep. I'll just peek up here one more time because since this is where I started for those that came in a little later, I'll show this area one more time. I still do kind of love the uh, dessert glasses, but I really don't. I'm like, I'm veering away from glassware sets because I just don't really relish the thought of shipping them. I am my shipping department right now, so trying to go easy on me. And I don't, I don't get paid. <laughs> it's a cute, cute mug. Ah, oh, you saw a robin in your yard today. Believe it or not, the wildlife in Tucson was pretty amazing. You would think that it's like so desolate and desert, but there's a tremendous amount of wildlife. And the way they learn to adapt is really incredible. Picture's really nice too. But let me, I'm in a good spot to flip this camera around. Let me, where's my settings? settings there it is camera I say don't make me turn this camera around <laughs> all right I will um, okay ah there I am all right everybody we have shopped the dog junkies thrift store I've got a nice little pile I'm gonna go check out uh, there will be some videos coming out very soon of uh, the picking adventures that I had with my friends Picker Road this morning. So be sure you are subscribed over on their channel and make sure, of course, you're subscribed on this channel. I am so close to 100,000. I can't even believe it. <laughs> like 5,000 away, like just 5,000. And I know that seems like a big number. But in the scope of things, it's it's so close. <laughs> Thank you for those that will go back and watch the replay. I really appreciate it. There will be a new video coming out tomorrow, uh, which, what do I find at that? Let me, I'm trying to give you a teaser. Hmm. Oh, I spent $50 on a single item. Yes, there. If that doesn't get you curious. I almost never do that at a thrift store. So I did that. Um, and that will be in tomorrow's video. And then there's other fun stuff coming this week. So thank you everybody for being here. And with that, go be profitable and make it fun. We'll see you on the next one.